Okay, here's the app on my phone. So I click on it, and there's the camera. So it logs you in. And then I click on the camera. Yeah, I know, battery low. So I click on the camera. Do, do, do. And it shows you what's going on. So that's me in my bed. Mm. Okay. And you see settings. So you click on that. But if you notice, um, you have the sound button. So you can see, you can hear what's going on. You have the microphone so you can speak to the, with speak and the person on the other side will hear you and the camera so you can take photos so you go to settings and you see all sorts of settings you got motion sensitivity and you detect you um, select the sensitivity then you have alarm action and let me make sure name motion enabled you got the IO alarm snapshot and you can record go back that's another thing dun 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 trying to remember just did this the other day no. No. You can schedule a recording. Okay. Go back. Motion sensitivity back. Okay, let's go back to alarm action. Wow, well, I was a little bit confused because I didn't scroll all the way down. So you have your motion alarm, your I.O. alarm, your snapshot, and record. You also have your pre-record length. And if you scroll all the way to the bottom, you hit turn alert on. Okay. And then any footage it takes, it goes into your records. So let's see what happens if I leave the room. Okay, well I didn't. And you see it shows up here. MIPC, you got a notification, the alarm went off. And you can um, go to the alarm and see what's going on. The record shows you the pictures that you've taken and the alarm actions. So you see it took a picture of me. So you know who's in your room. And if they really make you mad, you can speak to them. So you can go back to live. And you can click on sound. And you can speak. Get out my room. Get out my room. <laughs> Dang. 
it can turn and you can snap a picture and it pops up you can also download the pictures and then when you're done you just go back to settings back to blah blah blah, blah. alarm action and turn it off and that's it you still have your records for proof go back camera records and you see it took a few pictures for you to look at and see what's going on so this has just been my demonstration of the motion alarm using my camcorder because my well cam sucks and you can see all the pictures it got the date and um think time at the top And this says 429, so I don't know what they need. <laughs> and then the pictures are saved to your phone, so if you don't want them, you can always go in, in your file manager and remove them. Okay. Because like anything, the pictures do take up memory. So that's it. Thank you and have a good day.